So I just received from LifeX their Wi-Fi enabled multicolor LED bulb. Uh, first thing I've already done is screwed it into place. It is the bulb on the left that we're going to be testing today. Uh, they recommend first thing to do is turn the power off, put the bulb in. Next step is turn the power on and once that's done you're going to see it cycle through various colors and you know it's now set into pairing mode. We can see that just works. So the next step I'm going to show you is how to connect it through the app onto your Wi-Fi network and then we can start playing around and having some fun with it. So I've already downloaded the app and you can see I have it open. The first thing I do is click on add bulbs. So now it's showing me plug in power on your LifeX bulb, connect to the bulb to the Wi-Fi, uh, join the network LifeX bulb. So it's showing me what to look for. Fast enter a password. So I'm going to close out of this. I'm going to go to my settings and I am going to go to my Wi-Fi networks and look for the LifeX one which they showed. So it should pop. There we go. Clicking on that and it looks like I'm connected now. I'm going to close out of settings and go back to the app and follow the steps in now connecting it. I'm going to push add bulbs again. Connect to Wi-Fi. All right, so perfect. Now it's pulling up. This is my home Wi-Fi. I'm going to connect to that. It's asking for my passcode, so I'll put this in. I'm assuming it's just going to store it permanently in there. And once this is finished, hopefully it should be very seamless in connecting the two. So we'll wait here. I assume now it's pulling it off of the LifeX network, putting it back onto my home one. And then hopefully this is going to, it's taking a little longer than I would expect from other bulbs I've tested, but hopefully this should be done any second now. So let's just hold on. And connecting. Bulb to be discovered. So yeah, this is definitely taking a little longer than I'd expect, but okay, here we go. It shows my home network. Tap that down. Okay, so it shows one. You could rename this bulb, and you could also add as many bulbs as you'd like to if you want multiple rooms or multiple bulbs in one room. You could power it off from there. So I'm going to turn the bulb on now, and this is through my app. Let's see, it turns on there. Um, I'll get, do a screenshot also of my actual app, but here now I have the ability to, these are different whites, I can go into color and physically start changing it, which this is pretty neat. This should start becoming like really blue and purple looking. Definitely a little cooler looking in person as opposed to the camera, but this will make it a little more red now. Um, could really adjust the colors here and then dim it down as well, which is pretty neat. Bring it back more towards like a yellowish green. Definitely pretty cool. There's different features on here too. We'll go through that. For instance, one of them, there's a strobe mode. They don't recommend if you have pets around or around certain people, but you could do it and it'll make a strobe light. You can do candle flickering. Color cycle. I guess this is going to rotate through various different colors. Um, definitely pretty neat. This bulb, I believe, is $99. It's not cheap, especially if you're looking to use a bunch of them, but just from playing around for a minute here, um, is really cool. I mean, if you have the money to spend, you could really make um, a really neat atmosphere, whether you're talking about a party, a nice dinner, whatever it may be, just by being able to have multiple lights change different colors, as well as just change the mood and the lighting of a room. This is playing around just in the whites mode, which is separate all, separate from all the colors, so you can really choose your variation of how pure of a white or more of like a yellowish light. Um, I have to say I'm impressed. I'm definitely impressed. Um, there's different effects here, like we could do, this is an ocean theme that's already pre-programmed. This looks like this is a nature theme. Once again, I'm going to be doing screenshots of my app, but just from playing around, this is pretty neat. And I do have this incorporated with 
my Nest smoke detector, CO2 detector, and thermostat. So I'll be doing an independent review of that to see how it incorporates in with that for emergency alerts. So I would say all in all this is very simple to set up. The hardest part was waiting for it to connect on the app which you saw it took maybe 30, it took under a minute so very, uh, very positive reviews so far about this light.